The other night we had 2.6 inches of rain uh, and that came in about 25 minutes. That was the official report out at the airport. And what that comes out to when we calculated it is a roughly uh, a little over 4 billion gallons of water if you, if you move that over the entire city limits of Amarillo. And what that equates to is about 5 feet of water on top of 2,700 football fields just to kind of put it into perspective of how much water that we had to move through our system. And it cleared out in a little over two hours so uh, we felt like the drainage system worked pretty well for that uh, big of a rain event. We have five playa lakes that we maintain. Uh, we pump from those lakes as well so all of the storm sewers uh, make their way into a playa lake somewhere at some point in time and they're pumped from that location and out of the city. So you know our job is to make sure that those storm inlets, inlets are clean and that uh, we have a, a nice path for that water to uh, to make its way into those playas so that we can manage it. You know it, it's really difficult to manage drainage in, in a flat part of the world like the Texas Panhandle. A normal rain event will move out anything less than an inch we can usually clear everything out of the streets and, and the drainage systems within about 40 minutes but this significant event took about uh, two hours to do. And, and that, again, is a number that we're pretty comfortable with uh, as far as the system is concerned. We do know that there's areas that are low-lying and they're hard to, uh, hard to drain out, a little bit slower to drain out. But again, the system is doing its job as it's designed to do.